one of the biggest challenges for people growing an online business is comparitis. What I'm talking about is when people get started. Now, I'm in Live Good, most amazing business there is, my opinion. <laughs> but what happens is people come in and they, you know, they all of a sudden they start looking at leaderboards, they start looking at other people are having success and they start comparing themselves to them. But you know, you don't know their journey or where they've been. You know, I've been online since 2003, I believe. I, I don't know, I can't remember. Um, even though <laughs> I do remember, but, and you know, when I, when I first started, I stunk, I had no idea. You know, I, I didn't have a big following and the following I had was family and friends, which nothing is wrong with that, but they weren't people looking for a business. So I could have done two things. I could have quit. And when I say quit, I mean quit the business. Because I do believe it's okay for people to switch businesses per se. But I wanted to grow a business. So what it meant is I had to go learn. Now, there are a couple people up there that were just the business I was in that was just amazing business. Um, it changed, so I, I left it and started doing something else. But uh, instead of comparing myself to them, what I did is I went to learn from them, meaning I wanted to go, what are they doing? At that time, blogging was unbelievable. I mean, you, I'd post a blog a day and so did many of the leaders. So that's how I started blogging. But I started seeing what they did. I got on their email list. I started getting on their YouTube channels. And I just followed. I listened to them. Now, I didn't agree with everything they did, but I did learn marketing techniques. I learned what is the right way to build a business? What is the right way to build a team? And I think rather than comparing, compete. Go say, okay. I mean, we just did it in Live Good. They just had a... a uh, the leader, the top money earner who is in our hierarchy, you know, it's unbelievable, but I follow him. Now, do I do everything he does? No. The, the next person in our hierarchy just po posted that he made $130,000 in live good in 14 months. 10 grand a month. Pretty cool, right? So I'm not doing that yet. So can I compare myself? No. What I'm going to do is I'm competing, but I'm also going to go see what they do. Now, the leading money earner posted this. This is May 3rd, I believe, 4th. This is Friday. We have uh, five Thursdays in May. So what he did, he posted a thing like, let's everybody go out and try to get five people, one each Thursday. And when I say get, that probably sounds not so good, but um, enroll five people. And I thought, okay, I can do this. I can do that. Guess what? I didn't enroll anybody yesterday because he posted this on Thursday morning or Wednesday morning or something. I didn't, I, I, I didn't enroll anybody, but I had 10 people, 10 people take a two and reserve a spot. Now I can't pull a plug for them. That, that's up to them. But a lot of these people come in and go, wow. Oh my gosh, I can't do this because there's already so many people in it. It doesn't mean anything. I tell a story a lot. It's uh, my seventh grade teacher. Okay, seventh grade teacher, which would have been in 1967, I believe. 66, maybe. 67. Science teacher. It was in Amway. All right? Amway. Think of this, 35 years, 36 years ago, Amway's still going strong. People are still making a lot of money in Amway. People are just joining Amway. I talked to another person the other day about Live Good Opportunity. And he came on, he was so excited because he started this new business. And I'm not going to name the name of it because I was in it. I didn't agree what the leaders did. Uh, and I didn't agree with the uh, transparency of some of their products because they hid facts from them. And I didn't agree with 
They're auto ships. I mean, my, my goodness, I had to spend so much money in an auto ship, I couldn't afford to stay in. Two months. And now this leader, well, and he's been bashing Live Good, which that's why I left. I, I didn't agree with his personality. Uh, but what he did, he posted a thing about he has two houses in Destin, Florida. All right? I mean, those are expensive homes. I wanted to reach out and say, well, how many people on your team have two houses in Destin, Florida? Because that's not how it works in these things. That's not how it works in a lot of businesses. Leaders make money and the people that just join can't make it. So they make some money off them and then they leave. They get on, they talk about do this, do that. Well, you know, I'm not an influencer. So I was done with this industry, done. And I was on vacation in my travel van. I see my little travel van. That's our bed that uh, is up, but we usually fold that down a little bit. And uh, we have a full-size bed, my wife and I, and we go camping. Uh, we like to go to the beach, to the ocean. We live on the lake, but we like to go to the beach. L listen to those waves. Oh, my goodness. That's like God talking to me. Um, sorry. And seeing dolphins. And um, Now, yesterday out here, that we have an eagle nesting about you know, 300 yards from where I am. So we went out and took pictures of the eagle nesting. And they, an eagle signifies freedom for me. Anyway, that, that got off topic. Anyway, I was on vacation and an acquaintance. You know, I call him a friend, but, you know, he was a marketer. So, and I'm really cautious with what he does because very typical of internet marketers, they get on and they do something for a couple months and they go to something else. And because they have a list of people, I mean, buyers, a buying list. Usually anything they get into, they make a lot of money and then they leave. So I, I was cautiously opened up his email, but something told me to open it up. Maybe the subject line, do you want to make two grand a month? I think that's what it was. <laughs> you know, I wanted to stay at the beach longer and couldn't do it. So I thought I opened it and uh, I looked at it and thought, okay, he sent me a link to go watch a five minute video. So I did on vacation, right? Kind of sitting around at the ocean. My wife was out for a walk. So I listened to it. I kind of looked in disbelief because I, I looked at the products. The products made sense because I used those products. The membership made sense because I was going to save money on those products. And then making money made sense. But I, I I did something that was I was on vacation. So when, when I'm on vacation, you know I'm 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 all in with my wife. I'm not going to start doing business there. So I watched the video. Um, I think this was the 13th of February, 2023, and on the 22nd I got home and I joined. And that cost me money. I should have joined the first time I saw it because I'd be making probably just on the the matrix. I'd be four figures. I know it. But that's okay. I'm not comparing that. That was my decision, not anybody else's. I'm going to compete, though. So I joined. And guess what I did? I went back to these leaders, and I started looking at what they're doing. And I put together a blueprint, step by step. So when you become an affiliate, $40 one time, $40, $40, $40, $40, $40 one time fee. And then nine ninety five membership each month, so you can save money on products. And when you get in, I always suggest people go get some products, try them. So when people ask you any questions about me, go, oh yeah, I took that. That was amazing. The products are changing my life. They really are. Anyway, um, when you join our team, you get a blueprint, seven day blueprint. This is what you do each day. Boom, 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 giving you giving you the blueprint to build your business. So here's what you do. I got links down below, but here's what it is. It's joinmark.biz. Did you hear that first word? Join, joinmark.biz. Y'all take care. You have a blessed day and I will talk to you again tomorrow.